Over the last few months, we've driven across the province asking you, what's the worst unsafe road that you've driven on lately? We've talked to real people, heard real stories, and real safety concerns. Particularly our bus drivers driving down the road and they have to take the ditch at times because it was so bad and they couldn't even drive on the main part of the road. It's washboarded so bad that it'll actually kick the back end of your vehicle off to the side or if it's rained or there's wet conditions at all, you hydroplane and it's dangerous because you're dodging the holes so you're in and out of your lane. The local crew here does the best they can to patch them, but it's, it only stays for so long. By the end of the winter, they're all back. They're, they just peel off like a scab. It's unsafe. I avoid traveling that way. <laughs> Um, the ruts are just unbelievable. And then we had to pull over eventually because they were getting nauseous because their stomach was going like this for so long. They were car sick. Such a brutal road and even when they try and put gravel over it, it just doesn't seem to help. And ambulances actually have to sometimes pull over and start some of the machines up again because it's so rough. You know, if they don't feel safe traveling, that they're not going to come from town to town and therefore the industry and the businesses do suffer from that. It's, they've got so they don't want to go there anymore because of the roads. It doesn't take long to drive up and down that road. You have shocks, leaf springs, airbags broken. Something has to happen before we have bad accidents or it costs our community too much to survive. And now we want to hear from you. Nominate and vote at caask.ca slash worst roads. But hurry, time is running out. Your last chance to vote is at midnight.